Good morning. It is 5.11 in the morning. We're about to start off on the road trip in the 2022 Tesla Model X. I've never filled it up to 100%, so this is the first time we got it. We went all the way up to 99%. We're going to hit our first supercharger in Ogala, Nebraska, which is about 200 miles away from here. Fingers crossed we make it. Um, there is a, a, I do have a, a secondary uh, in case the primary is too far away. I figure we can stop in Brush, uh, Colorado uh, on our way out if I see the, you know, I don't want to drop below, I don't know, 30, 25, 30. Um, but we're going to maintain the speed. We're going to hit it just right. We're going to follow all the rules and, and follow what the car says. So this is going to be interesting. Uh, we should be leaving in a little bit. Just waiting on my beautiful wife and my daughter. And uh, we'll get underway. We'll get some video of the vehicle while we're driving on the highways. And uh, we're going to make this work. So I'll see you in a little bit. 99%. As you can see where I'm at right here. Awesome. Right, pretty cool we made it to Ola Gala and we're gonna use our first supercharging let me see if I can get this going it looks like that's working I think negotiating it's still blue don't know Where are we? Ola Gala there we go. It negotiated. And. What state is that? Nebraska. Okay, we're in Windy Grand Island with 4% charge. That was, uh, that was something. It's a nice one though, I mean. There's a lot of things here to do. A couple other Teslas here. 4% charge. Just, and you're already in it. Nope, not happening. All right. You go to school every day. All right. We had 4% charge when we pulled in here. Up here at Grand Island has been fantastic. They got lots of things an Arby's, Little Caesars, Subway, gas station, good superchargers. Um, right off the highway. I like it. Only problem is the bathrooms are a little bit nasty, but if you get by that, you'll, you'll, it's a good truck stop. Good, good place for a supercharger very happy with it and uh, it is a supercharger we came in at 4% been here about 30 35 minutes and is now at 90% so on to the next one okay we got to Shelby we had about 20% uh, charge left and we hooked in there's a lot of Tesla's here but we were able to hook in and we got uh, 146 kilowatts so we're putting on the 530 miles per hour. That says it's gonna take about 55 minutes to do a full charge. We're not gonna do a full charge. Um, there's lots of Teslas here. We got uh, a lot of S's, actually two S's, a Y. Uh, we are in Shelby, Iowa. It's not bad. You got a, you got a, you got a Dairy Queen and stuff across the street. What else you got in here? Got a Quick Picks over there. And Mama's in there. Mama does. And that's my daughter in the video. Sorry about that. Uh, wow, well, you're talking while I'm doing a video. So there you go. Anyways, uh, that's what we got right now. Our next stop is going to be Des Moines. So we're going to fill up here. And then we're going to get out and we're going to head over to Des Moines 
which uh, we should be there by about six. Uh, so yeah, it's going good. A couple of issues that I noticed in the morning when it was dark, we had a lot of phantom braking, but as soon as it became daylight, that sorted itself out. Um, I did get put in autopilot hell one time because where we were going through Omaha and cars are coming in and out and I had to take control. So we'll see what that does to my safety score. Not looking forward to that, but we'll see. So the road trip, I got to say one thing about this road trip. I don't feel like I've been driving since 530 this morning. It's now four o'clock. I am so relaxed. It has been so easy. Um, and it's the Model X uh, long range is fantastic. So it's um, it's a really, it's an amazing car. So I'll let you know how that goes. We're going to be charging up. I can see minutes that we've been here. We're up to 28%. Um, it's absolutely fantastic. And I'll see you in a bit. On the trip and we are in Des Moines Iowa um, we're at the come and go in Des Moines uh, supercharger figure we'll get uh, a quick supercharging in before we head off to Chicago um, I gotta say we drove for 12 hours yesterday does not feel like 12 hours it really didn't um, my son drove maybe three hours of that I drove the rest it was an amazingly easy trip. Just an amazingly um, relaxing, easy, e easy trip. Um, so with the Tesla, it has been a fun drive. Um, supercharging has cost me uh, a little bit more than I thought. Um, I thought we had a thousand free supercharger miles, but we do it's not on the account so I've sent a, a message to my service advisor about that and uh, we will see how that's working out um, and charging so I've been using a better route planner for to calculate our trip and the prices on a better route planner are half what I'm actually being charged um, at the supercharger through Tesla so I'm not sure if that's a glitch in a better route planner like they need to update the prices or if it's something that I've done wrong but yeah it's like so the better route planner will say oh uh, charging here will cost you 10 bucks and when I look at Tesla they charge 20 bucks so that's something that I'm gonna investigate I'm gonna look into um, I do not like I said the the thousand free supercharger miles for some reason, I don't see those on my account. So that's kind of crazy. So uh, I, I've sent off an email. I'll let you know how that one goes. And uh, I'll see you at the next stop. Okay, so I'm going to stop right there. Because it gets a little bit more interesting after that. Um, little did I know, in the next few minutes, our trip would take an unexpected turn. You remember those weird warnings that I got in the other video? Well... They started again at this supercharger and it went crazy. The car became possessed. Um, they were far worse. There were far many more of them. Uh, the yoke was going in and out. The, the chair, the driver's chair was going back and forth. Um, we got on the app. We spoke with uh, the Tesla folks on the app. We spoke with uh, was, they called us by the telephone and they were like, oh, we're going to try to do phone diagnostic. Um, they were like, you need to get to Urbandale 
we're going to send a tow for you. We waited over an hour for them to send a tow, um, which didn't come. The car, I took a chance, and uh, we took it out to Urbandale. Um, but that was the beginning of what is still going on uh, with the car every single time we, we supercharge. So day two of our trip began with our car being possessed. Stay tuned. I'm going to try to put that video together in the next couple of days um, with all the error codes and everything that we could find out uh, and the resolution that Tesla gave us so far. So right now we're, we're in Pittsburgh, so we're okay. We've made half of our trip. We're going to start the return trip tomorrow. But this, stay tuned to see what happens uh, to us after Des Moines. So thank you for watching. I really appreciate you guys. Oh, um, got a little surprise for Chicago, but uh, that's coming up in the next video. So <laughs> we'll see you in a little while. Thank you so much. Like subscribe, and comment. I'd be very grateful. Uh, you guys are awesome, and I'll see you on the road. Peace.